thanks for taking a look at our vehicle and let me uh, take you around to our uh, newest addition to the fleet. This is going to be our uh, 107 foot ascendant ladder. And when we were building this truck, we actually wanted to keep it the same as our configuration as our pumpers. So this is a putt configuration. And in the front here, we're going to have a, a jump line along with battery powered extrication tools where our other trucks had uh, hydraulic reel tools. This is going to be the same so we can pull up and take care of those as 20% of our call volume is uh, car X on the interstate. So we're thinking about safety. As we come around the truck, um, with this particular one, we went with a four seat configuration instead of a six seat. On the backs where we're gonna put a lot of our uh, uh, tools and accessories. So we'll take a peek here. As you'll see inside, we're gonna have lots of room to mount our portable extinguishers, our lights, our four foot, six foot hand tools so we can come straight out of the truck with everything that we need. Well, we really like the compartmentation of that the puck gives us. This particular one, the way that we've got it laid out, it's got 180 cubic feet of storage space. This vehicle, it being a uh, single axle on the rear is going to allow us to get into places that we haven't been able to get in with our 100 foot platform and it's going to allow us because we only got two stabilizers coming out to shoot the gap at apartments so that's a that's a big advantage here coming around with the puck configuration we did get a full depth compartmentation around And as you see on our ladder, for, um, for safety, we actually lit it up all the way up to the top. And then at the end, we had red lights so we could show that's the tip of the ladder. One of the things that we did change on here is the, the ladder was gonna be a two section 35 foot. And because we wanted more compartmentation, we changed that to a three section uh, 35 foot which give us more compartmentation in the front which I'll show you when we get there. We also decided that instead of having two ladders on each side it was more feasible for us to have compartmentation so instead of having a ladder here on the right side as well we put compartments. Another good thing here is right here is where that compartmentation really has taken effect with that uh, changing of the ladder. We got full depth, full uh, width compartments here, which give us more cubic feet. All right, this allowed us to have the toolboxes here at full depth, so we can actually organize our tools a lot better, so we can manage getting off the truck and getting what we need in, in a more organized fashion. So as we come to the other side of the truck now, I appreciate you taking the time to uh, go with me around our truck. We're very excited about this uh, vehicle getting into our fleet. And I uh, hope you have a good FDIC.